boy, those gargoyles were as spicy as ever. I better hold on to these souls that I just got right now. <clears throat> now on to the first battle of awakening. Greetings. Ah! Hello? I am Oswald of Karim, the partner. And you, where art thou going? I, uh, <clears throat> I was actually uh, going up this ladder to uh, ring the bell. Oh, that is thine desire, I see. But are you certain? Mm, yep. What's so strange about it? No, I mean, what is thine real reason why thou art here? I'm not 100% in love with your tone right now, and I already said it, to ring the bell. Hmm, are you positive? No other reasons? Uh, what? Yes, the real reason. I'm all ears. I'm not going anywhere. Go on, confess. Okay, look, I, I don't mean to be disrespectful, but the NPCs in this game are not exactly, um, normal. I I'm just trying to mind my own business, not making eye contact, so if you'll excuse me, I'll just, uh... Hello. What does thou meanest by not normal? DS fix disabled. I... I mean... Mm, stop asking me questions. I need to ring the bell to, to advance the, the story, right? I... Uh, that's what the plot is all about, right? Oh yes, well it's quite curious that you loaded the game after, let me see, after six months, just to ring this bell apparently. Who, who told you that? I mean, I mean, it's not true. I'm here to play the game all the way through. Is that so? Yeah, so piss off. Thank you. I'm gonna give you one more opportunity to tell me the truth. Quickly. You better make it count. <sighs> For Gwyn's sake, yes, that's the real reason. Now move. Really? Well, perhaps you want to think about it a little more while we enjoy this wonderful view. Oh, I'm sorry. I believe you don't own the remastered version. <laughs> Get the fuck out of my way before I remaster your face! Oh, good one. I'll tell you what. I'll move if thou can explain it how I'm presently standing here before thee. I thought I can only appear after the player rings the bell. Strange, isn't it? I don't know what you're talking about! <laughs> you know, many hollows run through here, but you're especially stubborn. Which makes me think that you might be hiding something. Get out of the way, you fuck! But perhaps it's possible that there's another reason. Something from your past that maybe you are not happy about? Maybe... A big mistake. In other words, a sin. All right, all right. <sighs> I'm here because I needed to show the audience that they have to ring the notification bell. Oh, just in time. Finally, the truth comes out. Now, precisely, why are you doing this? Confess. Because <sighs> last year everybody was like, ring the notification bell, ring the bell. See, YouTube is being stupid again, everybody's not receiving the notifications for my videos, and I chose, as a principle, not to bust people's balls with the ring the bell thing. That was not a wise choice, am I correct? Yes. Now, every time I upload a new video... Only a tiny sum of thine subscriber let us know that you've uploaded, yeah? Yeah, it's so frustrating. <laughs> Look, I just hate when people do that thing of telling you, make sure to subscribe, make sure to ring the bell, smash the like button. It's just a cheap trick. I hate it. I just didn't want to be annoying to people, you know? And look now, all of this just because I have moral values. Oh, how honorable. A fine example of good work ethics. <laughs> God damn it, will you shut up? <laughs> well, you don't upload very often, so maybe it's not that important after all. Besides, it seems like your videos still get recommended a lot, right? Yes, but I can't let my cartoons be at the mercy of a stupid YouTube algorithm all the time. How would you feel if your 1000 hours in the making animation was depending on that? What if my next video doesn't get recommended? All that work, it will be all for nothing. Not to mention random people stumble upon my videos all the time and they're judgmental because they don't know me and- Relax, I see. Well, hear me out. I can offer you an option, if you so desire. An option? Well, 
What is it? Yes, yes, that is my purpose after all. You see, the gods are merciful today. Let's just say that you could give me some of your souls, and in exchange, I will absolve thee from that bad decision of yours. Everything will be back to normal. So, what does thou sayest? Well, it's not like I have a choice. Look, I've got 10,000 souls here. I'm sure there will be more than enough, right? 12,000! <laughs> Precisely! Bitch, come on!